and a sobering warning from a teen vapor. The story of an Oak Creek High School student was shared tonight at a community forum. I was too weak to do anything. I felt like I was not a normal person. I really never thought this could happen to me. The teen was hospitalized for weeks. Rebecca Clough has the powerful words he wants others who vape to hear. The teen who didn't want to be identified wrote a letter to their fellow students. The message, I almost died from something that I thought was safe. I started vaping during my freshman year of high school. I am not even sure why I started. Oak Creek Athletic Director Scott Huller reads the words of a high school student, wrote as a warning to others. Almost two years later, I got really sick for like a month. The student is one of dozens of teens and young adults in the Milwaukee area who have been hospitalized from vaping. The doctor said I had permanently damaged my lungs. I hated being at that hospital because I could not do anything. I was too weak to do anything. 11 teens were hospitalized at Children's Hospital in Milwaukee between July and August. By the end of last month, the Wisconsin Department of Health reported 60 cases of severe lung damage from vaping. Children's Hospital pulmonologist Dr. Luella Amos and her team uncovered the vaping crisis. They want to know what the answer is, but I, I'm pretty certain we will not figure out what chemical it is. It's not one chemical, it's too complicated. In August, the city of Milwaukee's health department issued a public health alert, urging people to stop using the products immediately. I learned the hard way that vaping really is not worth the damage it does to you. TMJ4 has taken a comprehensive look at the vaping crisis. If you want more information, head to our website, tmj4.com. Reporting in Oak Creek, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4.